Sometimes people just don't get it. But this whole seed time and harvest thing is about more than just getting money, huh? being able to get nice things. God don't mind us having nice things, but at the end of the day, the money's for a mission. And that mission is to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ all over the world. It just takes money to do it. Anything that's gonna hinder me from sowing or tithing like I do, like I normally do, gotta shut it down. I like you dig into my seed. Seed is primary. When the seed ain't in place, then it throws off, it throws off everything else you got going on. You see what I'm saying? But, uh, you see, that's just a regular businessman. That's just a regular human dude. So think about, think about how God looking at it. God is not saying you give me my money back because it's not, it's, it's different. It's not like he, he's invested in the business. It's a little different. You know what I'm saying? Not as minuscule or, or minor as like it's just a business or whatever. But the thing is, you know, at the end of the day, the money's for a mission, right? Right? You got to think of that too. At the end of the day, everything that you get is for a bigger call than just you. It's bigger than just so you can go to the movie. It's bigger than just so you can get another car. It's bigger than just so you can get a house. You can get a house. God wants you to do a thing, but in the day, it's bigger than all of that. Man, so now, you know, God is saying, okay, what is he going to do if I get one house? Whatever, whatever character you got now, that money ain't going to have five years. But if you late, if you're a late person, you're going to be super late. Don't even care. Why? Because you got paid. You know what I'm saying? So, so now, back to the day by day thing. What happens is, if you do that for a while, not only will you see physical results, like you'll see that you're stacking up some money, which I always feels good. I always feel good that you got a little extra blouse over there. And, and that you don't have to touch. You know what I'm saying? But then also, that is that is setting, that is, that is magnetizing God to you. Saying, God is saying, be faithful. Yeah. You know, being about talk, being a good steward. Yeah. All that means is being a good manager. Yeah. All that means is, is like you find yourself together. Remember the talents? Yeah, one they had one, and one they had two, and then one they had uh, ten. Five, well, they had one, two, and five. You know what I'm saying? Well, don't fall in that one category. But you know, he said, put my money to use. What that means is, you handled it right. You didn't just throw my, you know, money has, um, you know, you treat, treat, treat your mother like you treat your woman. You protect her. You, don't, you wouldn't put your woman out on the car. You wouldn't just throw her out in the air, would you? No, you cherish her. You protect her. Why? Why you do that? Cause, cause, cause you love her. And you don't love money, don't get me wrong. You don't love money, but because you, because you love her, and one of the things about it is, because she's good to you, you want her to stay around. Cause you cherish her. I just you want the mother to stay around, don't you? Huh? Yeah. So, at the end of the day, you know, as far as the love part, you don't love money, you know what I'm saying? You just use money, but at the end of the day, you still send the signal out that you're a good steward. And you gotta care. You gotta care for it. See what I'm saying? And so, I think it's do the stuff that you can do. You know, I can't force God to give me no harm, but I can show him that I'm ready for one. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And so, so, these are the type of things you just gotta do. And you gotta do it now. You have all these bills, all this debt, you know what I'm saying? None of y'all ain't got no bank. You know what I'm saying? Nobody's put that bank up. They ain't got no bank, they ain't got no bank, they ain't no person. So do it now. And now when you decide to do something, let's get a house. You decide to do something, let's get a house. You decide to go forward. You, you planned it out. And you got, you know, you got little stands together. You know what I'm saying? Ain't, ain't, ain't nothing like having little stands, bro. You know? So, and sometimes it takes a little sacrifice to do it. Sometimes it will take me like you have, you have to know where you are and what you're trying to do and have, you have to have your goal at hand and know what you're trying to accomplish and then do what it takes to get it done. Out there we pride on them I call that out the money, rub my head on them They think I'm trying to dug it, kinda scared on me There ain't no use in running what I said on me I told you I was coming, take the street back, back to the one that on it first. Make them tapes, click, clack, hit rewind and then reverse. No time for all that shit, chat. I'm just trying to cuss the curse. 187 on the dome, drop them lies up in a hurts. Pressure bust.
pipe But the pipe's already broken for the chat to get your light Uncle Tom and like them tokens, all that TV make it hype In the background they been choking, stereo feeling the tight Me shut up, this what they open, open but I won't stop, cause I can't stop Dodging roadblocks, ducking crook cops Hit the hot spots, then I keep it locked, yeah Like the black ops, I'ma take the shot If I hit it right, then it gotta drop Knock them off the top, then get off the clock, yeah I'm going against the grain, I ain't caring what they talking about I'm Going against the grain, I ain't caring what they talking about I'm Going against the grain, I ain't caring what they talking about I'm Going against the grain